In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Chrome to get rid of a content lock box or get rid of anything on a web page, really. All you do is you select the content or part of it, right click it, inspect, and then Google Chrome is going to open the code, the HTML code that is in hierarchical format. And what you want to do is first you're going to see the part of the web page that you selected. That code is going to be highlighted by default in the HTML view. What you want to do is slowly you'll see that there's different levels. What you want to do is slowly move your mouse upwards and then pay attention down here noticing what gets selected as you move your mouse upward. The idea here is you want to get rid of this entire box, not just what you have selected. So move the mouse upward and as you do you're going to see more and more of that box being selected. You see how that's happening as I'm moving the mouse up and you want to keep moving the mouse upward slowly until the entire content lockbox becomes deselected and then you'll know you moved up one level too far. Still the content locked is highlighted, still highlighted, still highlighted, still highlighted. There, see how it just got deselected? So now you know you went up one level too far. Move back down one level, double click, the code's going to get selected and what you want to do is you want to move your mouse to the very end of all the code, press the space key, and then type in You want to type in style followed by the equal sign, followed by a quotation mark, display colon none semicolon and quotation mark. It's CSS code that is telling the web page to not display that content and remove it completely. And after you've typed that in, just move your mouse back over to the web page and click it and watch what happens. The content lockbox disappeared completely and now you have full access to the web page.